What is up guys, it's Mike Memo here, and welcome to my YouTube channel, and most of all, welcome to my Gothic 3 playthrough, the playthrough of the Beliard, sort of the Beliard, or the Hushishin, and welcome to episode part 2, um, part 2, episode 12, part 5, I believe, or 4, I think it was 5, where we finally gonna complete I'll start slash complete the uh, temple of Morasul. So without further ado, guys, let's go to the temple and kill the undead. Still low on arrows, but uh, screw arrows. I'll use magic at my disposal, or a smart moves. Now it's gonna be challenging with uh, limited supplies, but it has to do. <coughs> wow, I didn't totally not see him. <laughs> Go skeleton.
Good job, skeleton. Good job indeed. Now the problem is, I'm gonna need almost 300 ancient knowledge. It's gonna be expensive. Unless I use my tablets very, very smartly, which I will do, at least try to. Should have known he wasn't the only one.
Now went my healing potions again. My archery is really terribly blue. Sorry guys, but I'm really not in the mood. Didn't want to do a whole lot over again, you know, especially not in this uh, situation where I have issues. Where the hell is that priest? No priest? <laughs> the 
fuck? <laughs> Die? Or he, he died? What the hell? How did he die? <laughs> oh well, I'm not gonna complain. Well, this area is done. Found the artifact. I'm not going to let you get away with that, Mora. I'll kill you. Stop right there, Mora. I had enough of you, sir. the worms put away your weapon what do you want mora oh you forgot hey eh? make yourself useful mora hey old commander has no need especially a pushy one has no need for a weapon all right, so that is done. Pretty sure Reddick has a cure disease. Show me your goods. Now I'll keep it for a minute, well, at least for some time. For uh, should I need the endurance for tum tunnel rumbler, I can use this weapon in order to get it. Um, I can sell those. I can sell those. Same with the rings.
我妈多洗。Show me your goods. Well, that's karma. He doesn't have it. I need. Wait a minute. If I sleep in the bed, doesn't disease disappear as well? And I could use the gold for purely portions. Probably this will be enough. Doesn't matter. As if it were so easy. There isn't much left to help. Nope. That's lame. Not either. Where the big? Not either. What kind of alchemists are you? <laughs> Someday this will be over. Come on, man, you must have a cure disease. Pretty please? Oh, come on. <laughs> If you need them, they're nowhere to be found, and if you don't need them, then you can find them everywhere. I need some equipment. Look at what I've got then. <laughs> no one has cure disease. What a bunch of useless pricks. 
Are you serious? Go away. Show me your goods. Wow. Give me the key. I must kill Vatris. What? Get lost. There's nothing you must do here. I have orders from Gonzales. Now listen up. The prisoner belongs to me, not Gonzales, Julio, Sancho, or whoever else. If they insist on killing a water mage, let them catch their own. Gonzales won't be terribly happy about this. So what? If you keep bugging me about this, very soon I won't be terribly happy. I see. Show me your goods. Also non high. <sighs> Vatris is a prisoner in Lago. What are you waiting for then? Fabio won't let me near him. That's not my problem. So what am I to do now? I gave you an order, and when I said kill them all, I thought I was expressing myself clearly. And you come babbling about this Fabio? Listen, Fabio wasn't sent to Lago because of any terrific job he did. If he prevents you from carrying out your orders, he's a problem. And problems are there to be solved. Is this clear enough for you now? I should think so. All I need is one vial of freaking cure disease. <laughs> How much do I need for picking pockets? A thousand gold. A two thousand gold. Mm. Now I'm not quite sure how much gold um, I need for Geldern or Sildern, but I'm just gonna sell this so that I can train my pickpocket capabilities. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, I'm gonna kill Fabio. I'm just gonna kill him instead of pickpocketing. Do however. Show me. Come on. Seriously, man. Not a single merchant with a... Uh... Show me your goods. Here's your ancient vase from the temple. You've been to the temple? You really impress me. Show me the thing. Yes, this is it. At last. You have no idea for how long I've been after this. So we're even now. But I'll tell you what. I will give you something extra because you kept your promise. People like you are few and far between. It's been a great pleasure to meet you. Now that is pickpockets. Take care of yourself.
show me your goods. Literally no one has them. That must be some sort of joke. Which area has the most traders? Cave done, but I already checked all of them. Um, except for the Jens the Hunter, but I doubt he has one. And I know where to find one trainer that can teach me to resist, you know, the disease, but that one that I remember is in sure. Silden. And I haven't explored Silden yet, so I'm not going to do that. But first, uh, let me... Shall I invest the 15 learning points into Damage? How much thieving? 30. I can do this one. 30, that's about it. It's gonna cost me 1000 though. But in the long run it could give me a bit of gold here and there. Teach me something about thievery. Teach me to pick pockets. Creating a diversion is essential. Involve your victim in a conversation. You wouldn't believe how carelessly some people secure their purses. Often you can just pull them from their pockets. You aren't ready for that. Not yet, but soon, at some point. Now, it can go wrong, so be careful. Too hard. Too hard. Shh. Too hard. Would you teach me how to fight? <clears throat> That's the way. Carry on like that. I need to get strength at the minimum of 220. And then I have to train my hunting a bit so I can learn the mastery of uh, dual wield weaponry. Cost me a bit of gold, but... So far I can't find a trainer for cure disease anyways. Which is a bit fucked up, but... I'm trying to find a fucker that sells the motherfucker. Too hard. Show me your goods. It's a bit boring episode so far, but, you know, I really need that, uh, cure disease before I'm gonna go and move on to Bakaresh, first of all. Well, I'm gonna do the Where's the Guru books later, by the way. I think that's smarter, especially due to the fact I'm low on supplies and there will be many, many critters to kill, so I'm gonna do that later. But we will go to Bakaresh. Um, Bakaresh, Ishtar, and uh, we will kill a couple of water mages. Too hard. All right, already checked this guy, but not this guy over here, or nor the smith. Show me your goods. <laughs> also not.
too hard. Too hard. Show me your goods. Show me your goods. All right, now we go to Montera. And while I'm at it anyways, I'm gonna do the uh, Thorax Slay so I can get that quest done. Which required me to have five magic ore at the time I did Montera. I didn't have it so I couldn't complete it. But now I can and it will give me gold. Well, from the uh, bugger in that house up there. I'm gonna save here and there, you know, just quick save, just to make sure that if I get caught, I don't have to redo a lot. Impossible. All right, so he's, he's the hardest. Eventually they will all submit. Show me your goods. You're now working for Sabota again. Fine with me. I'll take you out of here. Good. Hey, stop right there, you bastard! What do you think you're doing? Just walking off with my slave? I'll pay you for the slave. Pay? First you'll pay for the audacity of stealing from me. Give me 1,000 gold coins and we'll forget the whole thing. I don't have the gold. All right. Then you will have to work for me from now on. But not just scrubbing floors, pal. That would be too easy. You will get five pieces of magic ore for my smithy within two days. And don't even think of being late. Otherwise, you won't leave the city alive. Got it? <laughs> Here are your five lumps of ore. All right. I'm gonna let it slide this time, but you better not be yanking my chain again. Never. Merrick isn't exactly your friend. No, not exactly. But as long as the mercenaries outnumber us in this city, you come to terms with it, or you die. Thoric's slave is working for you again. Very good, stranger. I knew I could rely on you. You will receive your reward immediately. Too hard. First, a break. Now, the arena one I can't, can't do yet. Because I'm not going to compete in the arena just yet. Um, what else merchant do I have here? Show me your goods. Wasn't Bazir one of those guys that I had to kill? But that problem will take care of itself at some point. You dirty thief. Show me your goods. Also not. Wow. <laughs> I 
Don't have some nice Damn, that hurts. But he didn't have it. Well, he didn't have it in any winch, god damn it. <laughs> he doesn't sell. Oh. The guy in between dots, but that means I have to go. Maybe the druid. Sorry for this, uh, you know, wandering about for pretty much no reason, but except the fact that I need cure disease. When it comes to a potion, that is. Now normally I wouldn't use Adonis capabilities as a servant of Baliar, but uh, it currently helps me go faster than uh, the, the fact that I have a disease. So my stamina doesn't really, you know, really, really, really slowly regenerate, which is really, really pointless. Heal my wounds. Light of Adonos, illuminate this body. But no shit to buy, really. Oh. I I'm starting to want to give up to find a freaking potion to cure disease. Sleeping is not gonna work. Already tried that. The alchemists don't seem to have them, all of them, so far at any rate, of the cities that I have currently explored. He doesn't have it either. <laughs> Because the problem is, look, look how slowly it regenerates. That means I'm gonna have to consume stamina, uh, well, endurance potions, you know. And I despise using that for one, and uh, for two, you know, I don't have that many. I think I only have about ten. Due to the fact that I n never used them and I gave only ten to the uh, fat man, the rest I sold. So you robbed the farmer, Farman. Did I? Well, it won't ruin him. You are completely without a conscience. I like that. You dirty thief!
Show me your goods. Also not. What a bunch of losers. A useless son of a bitch. All of the merchants. Well, you know, that's always the case. If you need it, it's nowhere to be found. But if you don't need it, why didn't I look for just spell scrolls? You know, that could have... I didn't totally not pay attention to spell scrolls. Let me, uh... <laughs> uh which one is the fastest? Um, I think the Mora. I can also buy spell scrolls. I totally forgot. I was totally focused on cure disease um, potions. Radic Okara. Show me your goods. He has arrows, I'm gonna purchase them in a minute, but uh serious? First I preferably prefer to buy a cure freaking disease. Show me Cure Poison. Um, Namora. I don't think I want to hear this. Show me. Now, isn't there a recipe that kind of? antidote for any kind of poison what about fuck it i'm gonna purchase it i'm you know if i'm done with uh wondering about cost me four healing potions oh fuck me Wow, okay. That's totally not worth it. Well, fuck it. I made a mistake, you know. I gotta deal with it. Cure disease potions are by far not as worthy as a uh, healing potion. Show me. I do not have much gold left.
but let me quickly uh, wh who was the guy that had lots of arrows I think it was in the car yeah the hunter I'm gonna keep to my gold nuggets just for now you know until I have completed the quest in Galdun when it comes to delivering the gold nuggets as well as the sulfur nuggets once I do once I've collected those and delivered those all the gold nuggets will go bye bye and that will increase my gold a bit but I do need arrows badly and preferably range of bows hmm. what kind of bow do I have now? can't wield those yet so it's no point in purchasing them four thousand for this alone okay boss of swords are, are niche How much is a print? Show me. I think uh, Bastard Sword was about what, twelve thousand. Understandable. So easy gold making. Sure. Mm, long shorts is indeed better, but I'm not gonna do that. Sure. Why not? No learning points left. All right then, to Braga we go, and uh, we're gonna kill the water mages, those that we can kill which are quest completed and done. I'm not gonna kill them just yet. I first make sure that I have good favors with all the water mages by doing that quest before I'm gonna actually kill Vatras, before I'm gonna actually kill Fabio, before I'm gonna actually kill Nefarious, Kronos, Satyrus, etc. Because otherwise it might, you know, blockade my questing. So, I think the smartest next episode is going to be the Temple of Al Shadim. Although I'm gonna will, well, I will have issues with it since I'm still quite low supplied. But um, I just gotta deal with it, I suppose. So uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And if you like what you see, subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, and I hope to see you guys in the next episode where we're gonna go to the Temple of Al Shadim and uh, getting one step closer to gain access to Ishtar. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you guys next time.